We would be honored if you would join us. Welcome to day 25 of the Phantom Manus. I want to talk to you about how I'm a member of the Jar Jar Binks Appreciation Society. It's not a real thing, but it is something I am. I am proud of Jar Jar Binks. I'm, I'm a Jar Jar fan. Um, you know, it's a generational thing. Um, it's a character that's been treated quite unfairly over the years. And in the 25 years of his, of his existence in Star Wars, which is, you know, half a cent, a quarter of a century... He's uh he's become, I think he's become quite beloved. Honestly, I think my generation, that were kids, you know, I was I was eleven, twelve when the Phantom Menace came out. We've sort of grown up with him. We've learned to appreciate Jar Jar Binks. He is the definition of, you know, the odd one out. The, the sort of the, the lonely, the lonely clumsy fool. You know, he's. He's been, that's the best way to put it, he hasn't totally been appreciated for, for what he can do, um, you know, because, you know, he's a little bit of a clumsy goofball. We all have moments like that. I have clumsy goofball moments too, but it doesn't mean I'm an idiot. So, I, I've always been a fan of Jar Jar, he's just, you know, this was the first figure I got of Jar Jar as a kid. Still holds up in my collection today. And uh, yeah, this is one I'd, I'd like to hold on to for as long as possible. Um, I have a lot of fond memories of, of getting this action figure as a kid. And uh, yeah, all these other ones that have sort of come along with it in recent years, and or more recent so. Um, you know, from Lego to you know, whatever this one's from. I can't even remember applause so it's one of the little they just make random stuff when it was like on the top of a tin or something like that can't remember but um you know coming to black series his own little book which was cool a little pop-up book i don't know why i kept it um it's, it is what it is i just wanted to show my appreciation for jar jar binks i also think it's probably more so the biggest person that's been affected by the Jar Jar hate over the years was Mr. Ahmed Best, who absolutely didn't deserve any of the terrible, terrible crap he got put through over the years. Um, I'm glad he is getting his recognition now from from the fans that you know want to share that. You know, it's it's a it's a good thing. I to have him come back into the fray would have been easily easy enough for him just to stay in obscurity and you know sort of disappear from it but um he's always sort of been around Ahmed Best he's always come back to do Jar Jar there was a few early on early episodes of the Clone Wars back in the day where he wasn't quite ready to come back I I believe the story is um he just wasn't yeah wasn't quite ready to jump back into the role of Jar Jar Binks as he is here um but yeah later later on he uh he, he, he sort of felt that it was time to time to make that return and I think we're glad he has um, obviously portraying Keller and Beck in the Mandalorian. Um, I don't think we're, I don't think that's the end of Jar Jar. I think we're going to see more of Mr. Binks here. <laughs> I think I'd love to sort of see, you know, I, th I think the whole thing with Keller and Beck, you know, going to, he's got a friend, what with a shuttle waiting nearby, you don't get to see who the friend is, but it's quite obvious it's a Naboo, it's a Naboo shuttle. And, uh, yeah, my bet is that Jar Jar Binks is, 
a good friend of Keller and Beck's, which I absolutely love that idea. I would love to see them together. Love to see them working in the same space. Um, you know, I'm sure Jar Jar feels absolutely horrible for what he got manipulated into doing in Attack of the Clones. Um, you know, granting granting the emergency powers to the Supreme Chancellor. You know, they, they sort of they sort of pushed him into that, and um, you know, it it didn't pay off in the end for the Republic. So I'm sure Jar Jar is living with a lot of a lot of guilt. Um, he, he was just trying to do the right thing, man. Um, but yeah, lastly, before I say anything else, I just want to share, if I can get the clip, I will add it on to the end of the video, but I basically want to share a clip of, um, now I think it was Star Wars Celebration Chicago, um, from 2019, where Ahmed Best was greeted on stage on the Star Wars show stage with a thunderous applause, and it was a moment I won't ever forget, um, you know, I, I uploaded it to YouTube that very that very moment um, while I was there at Star Wars Celebration in Chicago. Um, and yeah, it was an incredible moment. And I just, I hope today I'm at best. I doubt you're ever going to see this, but I just want to say I appreciate everything you've done. Um, the fan base at large definitely loves you, appreciates everything you've done. Um don't worry about those old fogies that didn't like you back in the 90s. Um, we're here today to appreciate Jar Jar Binks here on the 25th of May. Hope you've enjoyed this video. We'll see you again for another one. May the force be with you always. Mm -hmm.